Hi there, St. Gabe's. I'm just going to explain how templates will work. So the first things first, we need to understand that we need to go above. Gabe's, this is uh, me explaining how the templates are going to work to put in your soft chocolate session. First things first, you're going to have to realize you have to go on the top here, insert under, sorry, under tools, go to style builder. You could either press F11 also. Currently I have only one in there so I need to start putting all of them that I've given you earlier so you need to go import find it on your desktop so I put it under my downloads they're all zip files I need to put all of these five four three two one six in your case and the old one so open now put incomplete do the same thing for the other ones four three two four. okay two's already existed that's good one it will even tell you if it's already existed and then the old one i'm not sure if it's already on there there we go okay so once that is done now you can actually change each one this is the other toolbars you could play with so if you don't like that wood look you could change it into a different kind of pattern and then it will give you the different look banner text if you don't want the black you could change it and so forth the most important thing to do at the end when you change one you have to save as and remember that name so same thing for the content how do you want the content to look like headings are essential you also need to know the sidebar. Do you want it as a brown color, a footer at the bottom? And that's that's that. There's even a video to explain to you right there if you need to. So I just wanted to explain it quickly. So once you've done that, you need to start putting an actual template in there. Right now I have oil slick as my template. It says in the bottom. So what I need to do now is go to properties, style properties, and select one of the ones that are personal styles. I personally like the St. Gabriel's Master Template 6. You could use any one you like. So if I choose the 6 one, there it is right there. Uh, you could start importing a class. So let, I'll open, open from Softshot Cloud. I'll import one of my lessons in here. So let's say, oh, wait, let's do print advertising for ma uh, marketing and management. Okay, uh, don't save. So I'll open one already that has that template. Okay, so you will realize that the heading it actually looks like the actual green writing you have. The best thing to do is view it. This is the viewing body right here. And see if you like it. So this is what it actually will appear at the end. Another essential thing that we need to keep in mind, we need to change property of St. Gabriel's Cyber School. It should say online school. So to do any changes like that, I'll go back to create to my understanding we go back to style properties and title and layout under the title and layout this is where we're going to change online school since we've changed our name recently we should be changing it under here too this is the sections that you could actually click off to if you want other features available like an arrow or a table of contents page drop down menu at the top of the page and so forth totally up to you so just click yes and then go to save to soft Truck cloud that was my mam 2090 class it's highlighted awesome i'm going to override it as it asked me and always says it makes a package the reason why it says it makes a package so then it actually is a backup for it to on your desktop but you have to take the effort of finding it after so once that's saved now it was going to say saint gabriel's online school also so you could play with your templates if you don't like the ones that we have and then go forward from there hopefully that helps